Alright, good evening folks, and welcome back to our Friday Fright series, where of course we're continue on with Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines, and sorry for the slightly jarring start today. Right as I started the stream, the game crashed on me, so I had to start it up right as we got going. Good times, but oh well, what are you gonna do? So let's uh, jump right on into um, where I've left off. Not quite where we left in the last episode, because I did want to go to the uh, store to sell some stuff off cam. And I also wanted to, before we do the whole... Um, 
Museum quest, I figured, what the heck, let's go back to our apartment and check in with our lovely new ghoul, and also check in to see if Mercurio's okay. I don't know if he's alright yet. Eventually, at some point in the game, he will be, be available to be a very good merchant selling, like, black market weaponry. Um, so I'm hoping maybe that's around this time. So let's go check into our apartment first. I did, of course, already go to the pawn, uh, pawn shop off camera and uh, sell some things. So we've actually got some pretty decent cash at the moment. So let's go check in at our apartment and see if our lovely new ghoul is uh, there and if we can get anything from her. My god, she is. Yes! Hello! I forget your name. Hi! Finally, you're back. I thought maybe something happened to you. Nope. I shouldn't even think such a thing. I mean, if you disappeared, how could I go on? You wouldn't. But you're here now. I'm so glad when you're near me. Excellent. So, hey, uh, hmm. Calm, calm down, my pet. Here, take me internally. I'm forever yours. <sighs> this feeling. Uh-huh. It's, it's. Love. I mean, not really, but sure. <laughs> oh, all I can feel is love for you. Vampire blood's a hell of a drug. So, um, and I for you, Heather. That's her name, Heather. That's her name, Heather. <laughs> right there we go. <laughs> I almost forgot. I got a college loan check today. Here, I want you to take some of the money. College loan check, you say? I mean, I really wouldn't want to take so much college loan check, but considering the game we're in, thanks! I could use some new clothes. I'll try to get more, you know. Oh, 500 bucks, cool. For now, share your blood. Actually, I don't need to share her blood with me. I filled up on blood earlier before starting the episode. So, um, good, I'll be back later in case you want to give me something else. Cool. Later, Heather. All right. You know, while we're here, we might as well check our computer for emails. Da, 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 da. Oh, God. Uh, enter. There we go. Oh, six. Oh, my God. We have a couple of things. Six. Nicely done. Experience. That's the one from LaCroix with the, uh, the werewolf stuff. Your assistance was much appreciated in regards to the werewolf blood. Please find your payment in the mailbox. Already got that ages ago. If you haven't already done so. All right, well, next, clearly. Oh, Mercurio! Oh, cool! Stop by my apartment, you get a chance? I'll set you up. Beautiful, awesome, Mercurio is alive. We can get crap from him. Cool. Also, maybe I should have drank some blood from Heather. I just noticed I'm a little bit shy on blood. Not quite fool. Hmm. All right, next email. Don't touch the butter. Wait, what? I'm just going to go ahead and skip. <laughs> a sacrifice. A friend. A bishop is sacrificed for the king. Cool. All right. Yeah. Yeah. That's one of those other cryptic emails. Good times. Okay. Well, good. Good. Good times there. Good times. Hi, uh, Heather. Real quick. Real Anything quick. for you. Yeah. Um, share your blood with me. With pleasure. Yeah. I, I need just a tiny little bit more blood. Are we... Oh, I have to hit one. It's all mine. <laughs> oh, God. She's real low. Okay. Be real quick about it. And we're good. <laughs> Perfect. Just a tiny little bit. Thank you, Heather. I'll be back later. I appreciate it. Enjoy my horrible, crappy apartment here that I have. Let's close the door. There we go. <laughs> all right. Let's check out on uh, Mercurio. See how he's doing. And then we'll head to the museum. And, oh, by the way, I also don't have Ghost Tube with me today. Unfortunately, I went hiking earlier today and forgot to charge my phone before doing so. So, um, my phone's dead at the moment. <laughs> I did not pay attention to my charge. So, yes, even if I would have hooked up my phone to my computer tonight, it wouldn't have been enough to, uh, maintain Ghost Tube, sadly. But, oh, well, what are you gonna do? And Dizzy, maybe have a snack as well. Yes, that's what we did! And Trenton, glad I couldn't make it to the stream. Love the content you put out. Well, thank you, my friend. Glad you could make it as well. And glad you enjoy. Mercurio! Yes, hello, my friend. Went downtown to get my fix. 
When I went up to the top of the tower, uh -huh. I hear LaCroix shouting from down the hall. Yeah, he's, he's pretty disturbed about the sarcophagus. Yeah, he's he's kind of a pain. I'm not wrapped up in it. I am very much wrapped up in it. You're lucky. Anything I can do for you tonight? Oh. Hey, how are you feeling, buddy? I tell you, that blood you guys got's an amazing thing. Help close up a few wounds. This back alley patch fixed up the rest. I needed that feeling. Good reminder not to overestimate my ability. Mm -hmm, Last mm -hmm. time it's gonna happen. Fair, I doubt that. I need some info. Concerning? Weapons. Specifically? Okay, I mean, I, I know his answer to this, but I'm gonna hit four anyways. A tactical nuke! Only a lunatic would want that kind of ordinance. That's why they got him in Washington. Fair, fair. Hey, I was looking for some other weapons. Specifically? Flamethrower? Oh, yeah, I got a lot of requests for those. I blend the movies. <laughs> Everybody thinks they're a riot till they set their friends on fire. That is fair. They're not very easy to get hold of. I got a Vegas connection for those. Vegas, you say? I was out there, I had to shoot my way to the state line. Ah, fair, fair. I was looking for some other weapons. Specifically? Yeah, see, now this is the one I was really wanting to know about because it's my favorite weapon in the game. Combat shotgun! What you want is a Spaz 15. Oh, yeah! I got a connection for those, but I haven't seen him in a while. I think he's in Mexico. As soon as he gets back, I'll have a few of them. Excellent. Put together a dragon's breath, too. Yes! Spits WP rounds. A few nights work. Yes! That is what I need and what I want. That is my favorite gun in this game because, of course, fighting other vampires... Fire is very deadly. Shotguns, also very deadly. You mix the two with a dragon's breath shotgun. Oh, yeah, it's the good stuff. That is the good stuff. So, hey, let me see what you're selling at the moment. Though, I'm actually intrigued. Let's go back to the weapons thing. Actually, I don't think I've ever bought a sniper rifle from you in all the times I've played, but I'm going to ask. Not easy, even in this country. I doubt that. A military-grade sniper rifle with 50 caliber ammo could take a man apart at quite a distance. Makes the Secret Service nervous. I can, however, get my hands on a SWAT rifle. Give me some time. Awesome. Also, it's it's honestly not that difficult in America to buy a 50 caliber Barrett, frankly. So, hey, what are you selling besides that? Oh, nothing of value. Nothing of value. All right, I'm out. Thank you, Mercurio. I'll talk to you later. I'm going to go to a museum now. Because that is the main mission we have. Because, dear Lord, I really was hoping... It's been so long since I played this game. I figured after we did the whole grout mission, we would have unlocked Hollywood, but no, we still haven't. So we ha really we've got to do the whole museum mission before the uh, Hollywood opens up. So let us head that way. Oh God, I'm worried about this mission. It's I remember it being. See, I, I thought at first when we went to the ship that that was the one I was thinking about that was, like, really long and annoying. But I actually looked into some things after we did that one, and it turned out to be not so much. It was the museum that I remembered being long and annoying, which happens, like, fairly soon after. So, all right, let's go do this one. <laughs> oh, God. Just drive. All right, back to downtown. Let's go up to LaCroix Tower. <sighs> Talk to Chunk again, go upstairs, and then we'll do the museum. Alright, right in here. Excellent. Excellent. Oh boy, hopefully we can finish this all in one episode. Let's find out. Hi, Chunk! Yeah, you go right on up and see Mr. LaCroix. Hmm. Thank you, Chunk. Better mind gland oil and that new badge polish really makes this sucker shine. Okay, good for you. <laughs> All right, let's head on upstairs and go to the museum. Oh, boy. Penthouse. Man, I wish I had a penthouse. Not one that looks like this, though. This is gaudy as crap. <laughs> Hi, LaCroix. The car is waiting. Excellent. I'm ready to go. There is a degree of immediacy attached to this task. Yeah, 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 yeah. Blah, 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 blah. Fast. And, as on the Dane, you are not to open the Ankaran sarcophagus for any reason. Got it. Excuse me. I'm also not supposed to kill any people, if I remember correctly, so, okay, let's go. Oh, God! Wait, what? Oh, do I actually have to go find the car? Okay, hold on. <laughs> the prince would appreciate you, t you taking the Ankaran sarcophagus from the museum and bringing it to the... To him for safekeeping. 
And do it without killing anyone if possible. Okay, so... I guess we go to our cabbie friend downstairs. I figured, like, the, um... Elizabeth Dane, it would just... Pop us there. But no. Alright. Let's go to our friendly cabbie. Hmm. And Dizzy, if only it was that simple to kill LaCroix and take his place. Hi, Cabby! Let's go. Museum this time. God, I just want to unlock Hollywood so we can move to the next area. Uh. <laughs> but sadly, Dizzy, yes, to kill him and take his place would require all sorts of politicking, etc. For, you know, all that jazz. Also, okay, so we're the hell are we <laughs> oh god i really don't remember this mission i mean that looks like a um that looks like a tremere thing but no hello note on a door due to unforeseen though un though fortunate circumstances the business of madame Leo leota has been relocated onto the santa monica pier Okay, not that I know anything about that, but fair. Fair. Alright, that means nothing for me. Hi, you officer! Hello, how are you? Hi, can we talk? No, apparently not. I'm, I'm gonna sneak. Also, oh god, we can't kill anyone uh, power-wise. Let's, oh yeah, let's go to command. Let's go to command. We haven't used that in a very long time, but... um. I think that should, that should, that should do us. That should do us. Because Blood Purge hurts people. I love it, but it hurts people. Oh, God. Sacrifice. A look into the long-standing tradition of human sacrifice. Magnificent. Ancient insects unlocking the se secret of ancient life. Coming in January. Jurassic Park. <laughs> yeah, so, uh, Blood Purge hurts people. I don't want to hurt people since we can't kill anyone. So let's go with Command. I'm pretty sure if I'm remembering right, that should stop them dead in their tracks. Oh, boy. All right, we are in the museum. Oh, boy! We're in the museum. We are in the museum. Oh, no. Let's go upstairs. I have no idea where we are. <laughs> we are so boned. Oh, boy. I can't kill anyone. Ugh. Why am I going upstairs? I don't know, but I feel like I should do this. <laughs> Ooh. Hi. Hello. Well, there's a person over there. All right. No, I don't want to go near a person right now. What is that? I don't know. Nothing. You? Nothing. Uh, what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Still just sneaking at the moment. You know what? Let's just not sneak. If we need to, we'll command someone and kind of roll with it from there. Oh, new area. No, none of these open. Seems weird. Seems like a panel that would really be good. Roof access. That might be good for later. Hmm. And Joe versus Joe. Thank you for playing my mod, Area 15. Oh, you're the maker of Area 15. Oh, cool. Well, thank you for making a fun mod. I've been enjoying that one so far. Where the hell am I going? <laughs> yeah, it's been a fun mod so far. I've been I've been enjoying it. Okay. I hear music. All right, um, then we also were, like, right, we did a complete circle. Hello. All right, so the one thing we could open was by this. What is this museum office key? Cool. Awesome. Oh, my God. We literally did a complete circle of the entire area. <laughs> I remember. Ooh, a note. Damned funny. You scared the crap out of the cleaning crew. Now would you put the damned wrapper back in its exhibit? Oh, and don't leave your keys lying around or Marsha will fire your ass. Yeah, that sounds right. Hmm. 
Ooh, they're coming towards me. All right, I think we're good now. Ha-ha! Yes! Thank you, stereo headphones. All right, let's follow this dude. I've, I have no idea where I'm going. <laughs> All right, let's just follow him, though. Follow him. Uh, Rhino. <laughs> I love a good natural history museum. Ooh, T-Rex head. Squid. Oh, what's, what's up here? Ooh, pterodactyl. Uh, let's see. What do we got here? What do we got here? Can I, like, jump onto this? Oh, boy. That looks like death. Okay. All right. So, we got a person patrolling there. Person patrolling down there. It's a, oh, God. We got another person there. Okay. So, there's two people on that level patrolling. But it looks like only one on the bottom floor. All right, there was a set of stairs there. Once that guy goes by, let's just go down those stairs because I don't, I don't know, I don't see any other thing of importance here. And we got an office key. So I'm kind of thinking maybe if we go downstairs, that might be good. Ah, ha ha ha! There we go. He's gone. He's gone. Lovely. Down we go. Oh, God! Oh, how did he not see me? It's great being a vampire. <laughs> Seriously, how did he not see me? <laughs> oh, that was the T-Rex. I was about to say, what the hell was that sound? Oh, hi, guy. Random dude. Seriously, how did that man not see me? All right, we got some doors over here. Let's go check these out. Ooh, Velociraptor. Dinosaurs. All right, what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Ooh, anything here? Nope. What about this? Hey, we used our keys for that. Cool. Close. Uh, what's over here? All right, we got an office. All right, you know what? There was another thing over the other way. I want to check that out. I don't know where we're going right now, so... <laughs> it's been so long since I've played this game before. Uh, previously. I do not remember. Let's go check out this thing. Yeah, that guy shouldn't see me. Excellent. Ha-ha! Ooh, computer. Uh, email and say, I mean, email, sure, why not? Control C. I love Gabe. Nice. <laughs> reminder! Just a reminder, Dr. Anders Johnson, a.k.a. the sarcophagus guy, will be working at the museum for the next few days. Show him the professional courtesy we show all of our guests. All right, so that's the, that's the guy doing the sarcophagus stuff. That statue on Daryl's workstation is creeping me out. I was working late the other night, and I swear I thought I saw it move. This isn't another gag, is it? If it is, I don't think it's funny. Pam. Mav has detected a virus in the attachment of this message. The virus has been quarantined. Any notice sent to blah, blah, blah. Those keys you found, they're Larry's. I'll tell him you left them in the lost and found. Okay, okay. Uh, menu. Uh, quit. I doubt we care about anything in sales, but let's check. Hack it again! More experience! Be you sit. Nope, get it again. Okay, that was, that was too much for us. Uh, email was fine, but sales is a no-go. <laughs> Alright, you know what? Also, I want to say, because I'm really paranoid about this whole mission, so let's just do that real quick. There we go. And info droid, Metal Gear, sneaking music intensifies. Oh, yeah. Why do I also hear a buzzing sound? I don't know. Nope, can't get in that. Ooh. Oh, can we get in here? Oh, hello. 
Oh. Hi, guy. Anything here? Oh, there's a key. Basement key. Cool. What's over here? Ooh, server. Can't get in. Okay, I think. I think we were, like, supposed to go up into that vent and go through there, and the guy didn't notice me, and I got the key, so, um, I think we're good. Alright, cool. Well, let's leave. Later, dude! You're an awful guard! <laughs> God bless my godlike vampiric sneaking. <laughs> Alright, where's the guy out here? We're good. Alright. Let's go back this way. I don't know. I just let's go back this way. This feels right. And boom. Perfect. There was an office over here. No, 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 no. Close the door. Anything in the office? No. Oh god, also I just remembered what is exactly the thing we're supposed to be finding for um Pisha. Two occult items bring to her. One is a fetish in the Oh, that was the thing we were just reading about in the uh the computer. Okay, okay, so we gotta find a fetish in the museum here. I knew that that sounded familiar when we read that email, but I wanted to be completely sure. So, okay, okay, that is what I thought it was. All right, good thing I checked. Now, where the hell is it gonna be? <laughs> Ooh, thing. Dork, Jan found them buried in the sofa downstairs and turned them into the lost and found. Stop leaving your damn keys all over the place or else next time I'm demanding a finder's fee, JJ. I don't know if that's going to help us in any way, but, you know, we're just going to go downstairs. What we got here? Nothing. What do we got over here? Ooh, pills. I can sell those! <laughs> alright, alright, let's save again. Really need to remember what the quick save key is, but I always forget. Alright. Ooh. Oh, the basement key! Oh, yes! We're good, we're good, we're good. Okay, what are we doing here? What are we doing here? Oh, boy! Hi, guy! Hello, officer! Well, this is bad. Hmm. Excuse me, are you... Why are you... Why, why, why is the security guard just hiding... In the corner of the stairs. He is awful at his job. <laughs> I'm kind of waiting for him now. What the hell? Yeah, I'm like stuck at... Oh, I guess the 78 at the top is the light level, isn't it? I'm going to look at the dude. Oh, he, oh, he's buying a soda. He's buying a soda. Okay, I saw the soda machine. Good for you, officer. Where are you going? Alright, he's going that way. He's going that way. What do we get? Oh! Oh my god, there's a camera there. Oh boy. Oh, he's going in there? Oh no. Oh no. Museum tour stay on the green line. Red line areas are restricted to museum personnel. And that dude is in there! Oh, oh, he's moving. He's moving again. He's moving again. Oh, God, he's coming back. He's coming back. Ah, crap. All right, we're not supposed to kill anyone here. We're not supposed to kill. There was a thing, though, in that room. There was a thing. You know what? He's at the soda machine. I'm going to go down this way. Later, dude. Oh, that camera was looking right at me. Oh, God. Oh, God, no. <laughs> Thank God I seem to be basically invisible so long as I sneak. Oh, there's another guard? Crap. Oh, and that dude goes in there. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, see, yep, this, oh boy, we're, we are screwed. 
And Siege, he needs all the sodas, apparently. All of the sodas. He just, I, wa I want that thing. I see the particles. I see the particles. Where'd that other dude go? What sort of thing was he? Oh, God, we got caught by the cameras. Oh, wait, what? How do we get caught by a camera? Oh, that dude's over there now. That dude's over there. Oh, this isn't good. This isn't good. That camera's like all the way down the hallway. Okay, okay, okay. They don't they don't seem to care anymore. Oh no. <laughs> Crap. Oh, this is good. this is gonna go badly for us, guys. This is gonna go real badly for us. Yeah, how do we not get caught by that camera, but we did by another one like way down the hall? Oh. I hear footsteps. Alright, he's in that room. Go, 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 go. Camera. And go, 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 go. You know what? I'm just going to do this to him. Hey, buddy. Command. Hey, there you are. I got that. I don't know what that was, but I got it. Hey, hold it. I commanded a dude. Got it. <laughs> Command him again. Ha <laughs> ha. I'm going to go this way. Oh, that's a camera at the end of the hall. Crap, 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 crap. Go, 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 go. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I may have made so many mistakes now. Oh, we can't, we can open the store. Ooh, desk. I will take both of those things. Ooh, good thing. Marshall changed the code again. He is on such a power trip. I think you're right. He managed to send it to everyone but you. Again, now that you ever check your mail. Anyways, the code's 2358. You owe me lunch. Oh my god, 2358. People, remember that? Commenters, remember that, please? 2358. Oh, Jesus. All right, there was a thing. Yeah, doing the command was a good plan. Command was a good plan. Let's go this way. Waiting. That camera's looking at me down there. We're good. Go, 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 go. What's this way? I have no idea. Ooh, a room. Oh, oh, wait, 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 wait. Is that the thing I need? Can I not? There we go. Uh. Oh my god. It is! Crap, thank god. Okay, okay, never mind. We're good. Two, three, five, eight. We no longer need to remember. That being said, other rooms. Oh, ah, crap! Camera sauce! Crap, crap, crap. Hey! Oh, God. Okay, you know what? What's that? I don't know. I, got, I found a workroom key. I can't get through! Crap! 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 Oh my god, I'm just stuck in the in here with these guys. I'm stuck. Hey, I'm gonna feast on you for a moment. There we go. <laughs> Perfect. Run, run, run! Nope, I can't run. I can't run. I'm stuck. I'm stuck in here. Uh, just run! You know what? Command him. There we go. There we go. I have no idea where I'm going anymore. Hey, what's this? Can I go in here? Huh. Oh, hey. It's the fetish statue! Oh my god, I was just trying to go in here to hide, but there we go. We have a thing. We have our... Th oh, wait. No, wrong button. Okay, okay, okay. I'm hurt. I am hurt. Let's look at the log. I think they've forgotten about me. <laughs> You've discovered the key, co the key code. The area where the Uncarned Sarcophagus is kept at the museum is 2358. Now get it from there and bring it to the prince. Oh, cool. So that door down there is where we need to go. Awesome. Wow. I really messed up things by getting caught by the security cameras. But you know what? I think we're going to be good. So long as we don't kill any more any people, we're fine. And dizzy curiosity killed the vampire. God, I know, right? Yeah, I think that I think they've forgotten about me now. I think I've been able to run away. 
That was my goal, to get into here to, like, get away from people, but... Oh, boy. Now I don't know how to get out, though. <laughs> oh, that guy's looking for me. He's got his gun out and everything. Okay, 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 okay. You know what? Let's do that real quick. Oh, another dude right there. That'll put him, like, make him daze for a second. Hi. Hey, and him too. Hey. Uh huh, you too. I'm going to need to just uh, command you. There we go. Uh, oh, God, you're in my way. You're in my way. Uh, you too. Command. Beautiful. Oh, you, oh, my God. Everyone's getting in my way. Close the door. Okay, let's run. Let's run. Let's run. Let's run. I'm hurt. Let's just run away. I am awful at stealth. Oh, hi, camera. <laughs> yep, they know I'm here. Then you know, just let's keep running. Let's just keep running. Let's just keep running. Oh, hi, guy. Whoa. He saw nothing. <laughs> Apparently, he actually didn't. What the? What? Okay, obviously, there probably was somewhere better for me to go where I, um... Could have avoided things like a freaking laser grid. <sighs> I'm awful at sneaking. Okay, 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 okay. Can I? No, I don't think there's a way for me to like jump over that and then crouch over that. You know what? Run. Screw it. Screw it. Oh, I can't go through. Command. Ha ha. He's running away. That did nothing. That did nothing. Uh, how do I get through? Oh God! I I have. He's he's. Oh my God! They're they're all they're all. Apparently that laser grid has damage. Um. Oh oh God! I'm I'm oh boy oh boy oh boy oh boy. I need apparently I need I need a key to get in here. Oh there's the key! Ha ha! Go! <laughs> You saw nothing, you fools! <laughs> God, I'm awful at stealth. Oh, you know what? They're not following, so I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Oh, hi! Oh, oh, hello. Cutscene. Um. I can't. Oh, hi, you. Beck, it was go it. through the trouble of stealing a box with a very ancient corpse. Uh -huh. This city's not that dull. I mean, it's really not dull if you follow me. I'm really bad at what I do. Hey, so Beckett, what are you doing here? I am an archaeologist. Oh. So I thought I'd indulge in a quick study of this Ankaran sarcophagus everyone's so riled up about. Cool. My guess, from what I've read about it, is that it's a mummified Mesopotamian king. Ooh, neat. I needed confirmation. Well, it doesn't seem to be here from what I just saw in the cutscene. What happened to it, though? Since it's missing, I'm inclined to believe it was stolen uh -huh. or intentionally misplaced, if you like. Clearly, though, it's not here. Mm hmm. Who stole it? Hmm. Interesting choice of words. Weren't you here to take it away? Wouldn't that make you an attempted thief? Oh, definitely, but I didn't do it, though. I was too late. Prince LaCroix asked me to bring it back to the Camarilla Protection. That definitely doesn't make it theft. Clearly not. How do I know you didn't steal it? If I stole it, I would know where it was. And most likely wouldn't be looking for it here. That's fair. That's fair. Did you get to examine it at all? Oh, I really wish I had. All this speculation about the sarcophagus containing an antediluvian and being a portent of Gehenna is making me cringe. <laughs> These are the kinds of ridiculous, superstitious assumptions I came here to debunk. Except problem is for you, buddy. Um, from when this game was released, Gehenna was going to happen real soon. So, But I'm going to ask, Gehenna? Armageddon, uh -huh. Doomsday, the end of all kindred. It's a common facet of most mythologies. Fear that the world will end. Many believe Cain and the antediluvians will return to consume or destroy all kindred. 
I wholeheartedly disagree. Well, it's certainly one of the three different options for Gehenna. It's just, again, you know, Vampire the Masquerade, whole wonderful, glorious tabletop RPG. Uh, the Gehenna, like, finale to the, like, first edition series had three different options for how Gehenna went. One, Kane came back, uh, Kane came back and, like, did the whole Kane thing. Two, the Antediluvians were, like, a weird, like, um, mystery thing. And the third was just God straight up being like, eh, screw this restart. <laughs> If I'm remembering correctly, it's been a long time since I looked into that. But hey, antediluvians? No one I know has ever met one. But each of the clans and their bloodlines supposedly trace their origin to an original vampire. An antediluvian. Yeah. Uh -huh. Some swear these grandsires still exist into the present. But then, kindred and kind believe a lot of strange things. They do, they do, they do. And Cain... Cain is the biblical first kindred and founder of the mythological first city, Enoch, a place where kindred and kind coexisted. I believe Cain's a figure concocted to personify the transition from nomadic society to agrarian society. That myth, like most, has been twisted by time. Except in this canon, it's true! Are there any other signs of Gehenna? What prophecy doesn't have vague, apocryphal signs? That's fair. Let's see. The usual ones cited are the appearance of thin blood, uh -huh. cane sighting, uh -huh. doom, gloom, that route. Yeah, doom and gloom is pretty typical. Thin bloods, you say? Thin bloods. They're a fascination of mine. They are considered a weaker, more human-like kindred. Hence the name, thin blood. But they are sired, same as any of us. I've heard a large concentration of them live in this city. They're one of the reasons I'm in Los Angeles. I know some. If you want to meet them, they're down by the beach. Can you tell me more about the Thin Bloods? Thin Bloods rarely exhibit features or powers of their clan, and many can't embrace. Some are even rumored to have reproduced. <gasps> Shock and grim! Are terrified that their weak blood heralds the dissipation of every bloodline. Somewhat of an ignorant reactionary response, don't you think? I mean, kind of. Why don't you believe in Gehenna? As I said, many cultures have the fear of some form of apocalypse. That is fair. Kindred believed in these stories when they were human, and naturally carried them over into kindred myth. But it doesn't take a supernatural act to cause widespread destruction. Also Humans fair. and kindred are just as capable of managing their own destruction as a deity. A self-realized Gehenna warrants more vigilance than a god-induced one, don't you agree? Such is my argument, which so frequently falls on deaf ears. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Oh, let's see what we got here. I could give a damn about this stuff. I just need to find a sarcophagus. It's all fascinating. How long have you been studying? You know what? I I'm intrigued. It's fascinating. How long have you been studying kindred lore? For 300 years, I've been trying to determine the function of our existence. Neat. The kindred's role in the world. I'm not content to attribute it to some act of supernatural biblical vengeance. We exist for a reason. And that would be Cain. And if it takes another 300, I'll figure it out. I mean, it. unfortunately for you, it is Cain, though. It, it is Cain. I mean, that, that is the literal canon lore of this whole entire series. It was Cain. <laughs> And Wolf, I too like this guy, but it was Kane. Uh, let's see what we got here. <laughs> We're an alien species from outer space. <laughs> you know, I like one, though. We're a predatory species, like lions. Yes, I've heard that theory before. It certainly seems plausible, but there's little proof to support it. Still, it's a better explanation than a divine sentence for manslaughter. Fair. I really don't know, though. I mean, I do, though. I know all the lore of this game. My sentiments exactly. But there's time to rectify that. Uh-huh. Well, my work here is stolen away into the night. Think I'll do the same. All right. If you find the sarcophagus, call the prince. Prince, good night. Also, man, after all of the just... Oh, boy, I really failed in that whole stealth thing. Why was no one in that room going, where did he go? <laughs> they just stopped chasing me once I got into that one room. Oh my god, look at my blood. Oh, also, hey, what's in the road? 
Ah, a knife. Never mind. Let's roll. All right, in here. Hmm. Oh, in Night Siri, you missed a horrible, a horrible stealth section by me. It went so wrong. So wrong. That's why I'm so low on blood. <laughs> Hi, Chunk. Oh, excuse me. I'm starting to doze off there. Oh, I need to get a guard animal of some sort to alert me when folks come in. Mm -hmm. Maybe one of them chimps like on that show Ape Detective? Ape Detective, oh, you say. That, that monkey always gets his man. Uh-huh. LaCroix is expecting me. What? Oh, yeah, uh, Mr. LaCroix is expecting you. For a young guy, he, he sure likes to work late. Me, I spent most of my youth in the entertainment industry. Yeah, I guarded the sets for over six top ten TV shows. Oh, did you now? Very cool. Well, later, Chunk. Excuse me. I wish to feed on you, but no, I think that might give me the diabetes. <laughs> oh, upstairs we go. And to the penthouse. Oh, I'm so low on blood. Hi, LaCroix. Things didn't go well. Hi. The folly of leadership is knowing that no matter what you do, behind your back there's hundreds, certain that their own solution is the sounder one. Mm -hmm. And that your decision was the byproduct of a whimsical dart toss. I mean, that's fair. I pronounced the blast sentence, and I soak the critical fallout. Uh -huh. I make the decisions no one else will. Leadership. I wear the albatross and a bullseye. Yeah, that makes sense. Um... Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. What is this about? The blood hunt on Nines Rodriguez for the murder of Alistair Grout will be called. Ooh, bad move. Rodriguez's execution is only a matter of time. That's a bad plan. I have lit the fuse. Oh, boy. If a war ignites, yep. it's my head that will sharpen the pikes for. At oh, it I really will. It's easier knowing that you, my most promising attendant, has relieved me of one encumbrance to me. Oh, I haven't, though. Do you need assistance bringing the sarcophagus up to my office? Oh, about that. <laughs> oh, oh. Also, first off, yeah, nines didn't do it. Um, but also, about the sarcophagus, it appears to have been stolen. Stolen? Yeah. Uh -huh. I. Stolen? Yep. How? Who yep. Would... Oh, Gary. Gary, you treasonous maggot. Gary? I should have anticipated your treachery, sewer rat. Uh huh. Gary, you say? The Nosferatu primogen. Uh -huh. The Nosferatu were responsible for finding out where the sarcophagus was taken after the Dane, and for giving keys to the museum. They were the only ones who knew. It's obvious to me now. My mistake. Mm hmm. Also, first off, Wolf, apparently the pub company for Bloodlines decided. The best way to make a sequel for the game is to fire everyone in every studio that ever had anything to do with it. Great plan, huh? I know, right? And Night Seer. No, no, I was just making a joke. <laughs> so, the nose for. I want him found. I uh huh. Found. Mm hmm. The sarcophagus could be exploited. Oh, definitely. Causing who knows what catastrophe to this city. If it were to fall into the wrong hands. I mean, if it was, if it is indeed an antediluvian, I don't honestly remember. I don't remember that far into the game. Uh, then yes, that could be very easily exploited. Per perhaps even someone could diablerize it and become super powerful. But when you say you want him found, you mean I'm assuming the Nosferatu lurk in the filth below the streets of Hollywood. Yes, Hollywood, I great. I know just where they hide. Hollywood is. Unfortunately, lacking in any Camarilla loyalties. Uh -huh. Hollywood's Baron is an Anarch named Isaac. Ah, Isaac's more civil yes. than the Anarchs downtown, but nonetheless, he wears his mistrust of me on his sleeve. Fair. He may know how to contact the Nosferatu. Find Gary and get him to talk. That sarcophagus could be used against us. Do not come back until you have it. Great. Now, I must announce the blood hunt and bear the brunt of all consequences. Escort him out. I mean, maybe, maybe, maybe you tell, I mean, I just, dot, dot, dot. Oh, I'm out. <laughs> uh, yep, things are going wrong. Chunk! Fear. Fear for everything. <laughs> All right, cool. We can finally go to freaking Hollywood. All right, let's also go to the creepy lady and see if we can give her the fetish that we found. Also, we found a book. Hold on. Let's actually, before we do that, what was that book that I found? 
I didn't even check it. I was just so panicking and running away that I was like, oh god, just run. Just run! You've been feeding on too many teenagers. Go suck on a librarian. Maybe you'll be able to figure this out. Oh, I need so much more research. I've got a couple of books I need more research for. Ugh, I need research five and six. Hold on a moment. What's my research at right now? Four? We do have 13 points. Yep. Ooh, that worked fire. You know, we're gonna, we're gonna leave that five points for something better later. Yeah, I kinda wanna get the blood boil. Let's just save up for that. That'll at least get me two of the books that I'm, I have. <laughs> All right, let's, um, nope, that needed six. Oh, that was bra, son of a, ah, son of a, I thought one of them was research five and I'm dumb. That was brawl two to get that one and the other twos are research six. You know what, you know what, screw it. What else do I need for research? Scholarship, son of a six, ow. Oh. <laughs> I need one more experience point. One more experience point and I can read those damn books. <sighs> all right, all right. Let's let's go to Hollywood. <laughs> Going somewhere. Actually, you know what? Uh let's go to let's go Oh, Hollywood. Why is the museum still there? Let's go to Santa Monica first. And I go see Heather again. I need blood. <laughs> Uh, What's the haps, bro? What's the haps? You suck. <laughs> All right, let's go see Heather again. I also realized I made a mistake when I told her to go to my place because she actually has a much nicer apartment downtown, and I just completely forgot that was a thing. And so now she's in my crappy flop of an apartment. But I mean, all right, fair. <laughs> I don't actually think that affects anything. But, you know, it'd be nice to be in somewhere nicer than my piece of crap apartment here. Hi, Heather. How are you? Oh, you're back. I am. I um, I went out this evening and uh -huh. I... Well, I met someone and he wouldn't leave me alone, so I... He came back here with me and... Uh-huh. Well, I thought you might want to, you know, want to drink his blood. You brought me? Uh, Heather, you're wonderful. I love coming home to find dinner waiting. Thank you, my pet. I'm just glad you're pleased. Um, he's in the bathroom. Don't worry, I locked him in. I'll go help myself. Thank you, Heather. Oh my God, that's so, that's so, that's so, that's so wonderful of you. Thank you. Hi. Hi, guy. Hey, what the hell is this shit? Uh huh. Let me out, God damn it! I'll kill that crazy bitch. No, you won't. No, you won't. Calm down. There's. You know, you'll do no such thing. As soon as I get out of here, I'm calling the goddamn cops. Let's see what they think of this, huh? I'll have them lock up both your asses. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Yeah, uh, whatever. After I drain you, you won't even know what year it is. What the hell does that mean? Wait, why are you looking at me like that? Hi. Hey. Your dinner. Come here, I've got a secret to tell you. Yes, I needed this. I mean, we're still not going to kill him because that would that would make us lose humanity, but um, let's just get a good deal of blood here. Oh, there we go. There we go. Oh, God, that wasn't nearly enough. Heather, clean up your mess, please. Master? Uh-huh. Uh, I fed on him. Hmm. Yeah, I fed on him. Get him out as long as the trance is lasting. I promise it'll be done by the time you get back. Awesome. All right. Uh, okay. Okay. Yeah. Goodbye, Heather. I don't. Yeah. Go take care of. Go take care of the filth. Here, I'm gonna have to find someone else to feed on. Uh, boy, that was not enough. <laughs> and Wolf, you could just stop by Walgreens and get some of those old people specs. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> no, no one back here. All right. We're fairly. Full on blood at the moment. Oh, wait. Hold on. Hold on. Nope. 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 If I... Wait. Hold on. Yep. No one's looking. No one's looking. There we go. 
Got him! Okay, that wasn't much considering, you know, homeless dude, but okay, it's some. Oh, and Nightseer, he's definitely not, but still, if I kill him, I would lose some humanity, and that's not good for me. I'd rather not give in to the beast. Excuse me, pardon me. Hi, Cabby! Let's go to Hollywood! Oh, finally we can go here. Thank crap. Also, sip of the drink. Uh, all right. New quests and new area. Oh, hi. Before. If I haven't seen you, neither is Isaac. So that's your next stop. Got it. Where can I find him? Isaac's in the jewelry store at the end of the street. Consider yourself invited. Thank you. I'll head over there. Thank you, random person. Oh, what's the end of the street? Which, there, there it's, it's a long street here. Yay, though, new area. Oh, also is that, oh my God, what was the name of that movie? Big Giant or something like that, I don't remember. All right, let's go find the jewelry store, talk to Isaac real quick. We have so many things here. There's hotels, there's stores, there's things. There's the old theater. There's also, if I'm remembering right, a cemetery here. We can do like a zombie thing in. But I don't re I don't quite remember that. What is this? What is this? Oh, yeah, it's a game company. Oh, jewelry. No. Side door? Ah, yes, side door. Beautiful. Iron Giant, thank you, Night Seer. <laughs> oh, and Tizzy, I'm just having some water this evening. Nice place. I like it. Hi, Isaac. Good evening, Neonate. Hi. Isaac Abrams. How's it going? I've been expecting you. Cool. Seems the wooden soldiers of the Camarilla shuffle in a little too often these nights. I know, right? That baby-faced two-bit Prince LaCroix got something to say to me? Uh, well, see, there's a whole thing. There's a whole thing. I'm looking for the Nosferatu. So, you've come to barter information with the sewer rats. Yep. LaCroix must really be desperate to be stooped to consorting with their kind. I know, right? They're asking for my help, of all people. I know, right? Uh, any idea where I could find them? Perhaps. However, before we discuss how I might help you, there is the matter of tribute. Tribute, you say? I don't like where this conversation is headed. Call me old-fashioned, but this is my barony, and as is tradition, a token of respect must be paid. That is fair. That is fair. I see. What do you want? What I want is a simple exchange. Last week, I paid for a certain item... A movie. Uh -huh. And this evening I got an email saying that the seller is ready to deliver it. Unfortunately, he's become a bit paranoid all of a sudden. Won't uh -huh. meet the person, won't drop it off, won't even answer his phone. Says he'll send the location of the pickup to a computer in the nearby internet cafe tonight. You see where I'm going with this? Unfortunately, yes. You want me to make the pickup easy enough. Go to the Ground Zero Internet Cafe. Look for a directory named Joseph K and use the password Kafka. There'll be an email in there that will specify a nearby location. Meet the contact, pick up the item, come back. Not too painful, right? You know what? Honestly, compared to the other things like LaCroix had me do, no, it's not too painful at all. So I'll... You know what? I'll do it, but I have some questions first. There'll be plenty of time for questions later. I'll explain everything when you get back. Crap. All right. There had better be... Package delivery. Never done that before. I'm gone. Excellent. In the meantime, consider yourself a welcome guest in my barony. Welcome to Hollywood. Thank you, Isaac. Neat. Oh, I can't look at his computers. Okay, so that is our first quest in this area. Let's kind of take a look around first before we end the stream tonight, because we do got a couple of minutes. I don't actually want to start this quest yet because, well, that just seems like it'll take a little bit longer. I, 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 I genuinely remember what's going on in here. Um, I can't wait for this once we go in here. I don't remember if we just do that ourselves or if it's like a thing we have to get a quest for. But, yay. Um, assuming it all goes well, it could also go horribly awry. Sunset print. Nope, nothing there. And we're gonna rest. Oh, my oh, God, oh hi! 
Everyone was worried sick about you. What? When you didn't show up and, and didn't call and nobody knew anything about what happened to you. Uh huh. I thought you were dead. Are you okay? You know what? Never mind. We have to help you. Oh. You're from my old life, aren't you? Who are you, though? It's me, Samantha. Don't you... Did you suffer an injury? Is that it? Let me make a call. We'll no, 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 no. We can talk. Maybe you'll remember something. The important thing is that they know that you're alive. Uh-huh. Don't worry about me, Samantha. I'm fine. I don't need help. I don't think you know what you're saying. Probably don't. I'm gonna help you. You'll see. Everybody just wants to see you safe and back to your old self. Wait here. I I'm gonna make a call. No, 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 but, but no. Oh, no. Okay, okay. Do I... Do I take her down? <laughs> Apparently that's from my old life, and, um... She's just... Yeah, I'm gonna let this play out. I don't remember what this does. And Nightseer, I don't remember what kind of vampire Isaac is. Can I go in here? Nope. Uh, hey, hey, ma'am, uh, ma'am. Oh boy, yep, she's making a call. Hey, Jenny. Yeah, it's Sam. Your mother believes well about you. Uh huh. You know who disappeared a little while ago? Uh huh. Yeah, I, I couldn't believe it either. He just uh, walked by me in Hollywood. He's uh, right I, here. I, I did. Hi. Anyhow, something seemed wrong, and I, and I wondered if you could call a few people. And well, he didn't recognize me at first, and I think it might be drugs or something. Yeah, yeah, maybe, maybe, maybe that. Oh. No, definitely not the police. Well, we can't just leave him here like this. He's... All right. Call them and I'll, and I'll keep him here. Just let everybody know he's alive and that we're going to get him some help. I should probably leave. Oh, masquerade violation! Son of a bit. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, dang it. You know what? I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. You know what? I'm out. You know what? I want to talk to her, though. No, it's not. No, I should have killed her. 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 Oh, well. Is she, she's following me. She's following me. She's following me. This. Oh, no. This. Oh, no. Oh, okay. Let's go somewhere. Let's go somewhere private. Excuse me, sir. Yeah, you stay down that alley, please. All right. All right. This has to happen. This has to occur. Um. Sorry, ma'am. Nope. Nope. Why didn't I feed? Oh, criminal violation! Son of a bitch! No! No! Oh, God! Oh, this is... Okay, command her. Command. Command. No, no. And now... Fi no, no, boy. This is... Oh, oh, she's gone now. She's gone now. To the sewers! To the... So oh, God, where'd you come from? Oh, boy. To the sewers. I'm out. Okay, okay. That, that went real wrong. Police are hunting me. They don't come into the sewers, right? I don't, God, I don't remember if they do or not. Rat! Well, this went wrong real quick. Real quick. Should have fed on her when she was calling on the phone. Should have done that, but I did not. Okay, I, di I didn't remember what happened with her. And yeah, we got a masquerade violation. Then we tried to feed on her and it all went sideways. Let's get another rat in here. Oh god, the, I still hear the cops. The fuzz are after me, man. Hey, the police are giving up. Yay! <laughs> okay, things went real wrong, though. And I think that's a good place to end the episode today. Oh god, that... I'm just, you know, today has not gone well for me. First, you know, we started okay at the, um at the museum and then it all went wrong for me and we just really really failed at the whole sneaking thing and now we have a masquerade violation on us so that's that's oh, i can't even pick that okay cool uh so yeah that's oh boy today today was a mixed bag but hopefully you all have enjoyed and you come back for the next when we'll go check out this uh internet cafe and see where it goes from there. But until that time, thank you for watching. And as always, have a good one.